Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Making It in Holland. As you can see today, we have another apartment tour just for you. We are still in Rotterdam, we are at the Lee Towers and today we are touring a 65 square meter one bedroom apartment that is 1,300 euros a month if you decide to rent it. And let's get started with the tour. First, let me close the door. All right, so right off the bat, we have the entryway, which is still quite spacious, but it is not as spacious as the penthouse that we toured last week. If you have no idea what I'm talking about, make sure to check out that tour after this one. I will be linking it down in the description, but I would still say it's relatively spacious. And behind the first door here, we again have our toilet. So let's come and check it out. So right off the bat, if you've seen the other penthouse tour, this is a lot smaller of a toilet and the finishes are relatively the same, although I am noticing some slight quality differences when it comes to the sink and the toilet. But overall, I'm still loving this marble tile look with the simple white paint. Now with this out of the way, I know you're very curious to see the living space, so let's go ahead and go inside. So in here we have our living and dining area. As you can see, it's all connected. It's one big space and the way it is designed is here in this zone, it is your kitchen and it is your dining. If you look here, you have a very similar kitchen set up to the other apartment. Again, you have all of your cabinetry above here and underneath here, you will also find your dishwasher and your fridge as well and the thing with these apartments because they are for rent they come with the standard furniture so you might recognize this desk again from the previous apartment tour as well here it's working as a dining table and swiftly moving on to this zone here where we have a mystery door and inside what we have is a simple he had effective storage room and you could see some of our gear here as well that we're storing during this shoot. So overall, I would still say this is a very, very great spacious apartment, especially if you're looking for something slightly on a budget, although I'm not saying 1,300 euros per month is relatively cheap if you have other options, but considering living here with two people, I think it turns out to be a quite decent living space that's bright and very, very spacious. So come with me over here to the living area and let's see what we have here. You probably recognize a lot of the furniture. So we have our dividing storage, we have our sofa, we have the end tables to put your coffee or tea, depending on your beverage of choice. Same LG TV over here as well. And Basically, the only difference here that you might pick up is the view because we are on the third floor and we are facing the street. You don't really have such a beautiful view as compared to the penthouse, but I can definitely say that if I was living here, I wouldn't mind it because the view is still relatively bright and beautiful. And with that said, let's now move into the bedroom and the bathroom. So the bedroom here is a different experience. It is a lot smaller, but as you can see, there is still a double bed and you still do have plenty of closet space. Of course, when you compare it with the penthouse from before, this is really not that glamorous, but you still have your closet space here. So this could be utilized his and hers or maybe mostly his or mostly hers, depending on who has most of the clothing items. And the last door behind me will lead us to our shower. And this is a little bit of a tight sort of arrangement, but you can always take this and move it a little bit further to make it easy for you. And I don't know why they've done it this way, but maybe if you rearrange them, you can maybe take both of these wardrobes and have them be next to each other. But I'm going to leave that up to you, to your creativity. If you were to rent this house, how would you rearrange this bedroom? With that said, let's see what is here. 
Here we have our bathroom and yes, it is definitely a lot smaller than what we've seen before. Here we only have one sink and we have integrated storage underneath here, which I think is very, very smart. And we have another stand that comes with the property here as well. And we only have our little shower. We don't have a bathtub, unfortunately, but I do have to say that this is still quite spacious here, uh, and I think this would still make a quite pleasant shower experience. Just make sure when you're leaving that you have enough room to be able to leave your shower. And then another thing I just noticed whoop, is that this has two different sets of light. So if you want to use the more dim light when you're showering for like more of an atmospheric experience, I think that's not such a bad idea. So basically, if you look at this property, 65 square meters, it's still quite bright, big and spacious, and you're only paying 1,300 euros a month, and that does include all the bills and the utilities as well. So if you're sharing this apartment with your partner, and if you are splitting the rent, I feel like it is still very luxury living on a budget, and it is relatively doable. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Let me know if you did down in the comments. Let me know if you want to see more house tours like this one. And until the next episode, you know what to do. Don't forget to stay awesome and I will see you very, very soon.